So welcome. Today we are going to reduce repos by license for method from the data taken along a sewer line. So this is a sewer line and uh, the data are taken from station 1, station 2 and station 3. The question reads that uh, the staff shows a reading taken from point K along proposed sewer line through point R1, R2, R3, R4, R5, R6, R7 and then L. Book the readings in standard format and then reduce the force by rise and fall method and apply arithmetic checks. So the first thing we are supposed to book the readings in the standard format and since it is rise and fall method, this is how we are supposed to book our data. We have the sewer line and uh, we have the staff readings and also we have stations. So at station 1, we have a back site of one uh, one point five five one, and it's here. Then we have uh, intermediate uh, intermediate site of one point zero two five. as intermediate site here. We have another intermediate site of one point eight seven six, one point eight seven six, and at this intermediate site reading too, we have a reduced therefore of nine fifty eight point five six. So our reduced repo is at station uh, reading area two, uh, reading reading area two, and that is R two. Then we have two point six eight three as our four site. Our station is, is at point three, so we are reading staff at point three, while at station one at the same time so we are at station two. So at station one it will be our four site two point six eight three. It's here. Then when we are at station two, it is it will be our back site. So back site of 0 0.82. Then we have staff at point four, that is R4. We are reading it at from station two and also from station three. From station two, we have a, a back site of from uh, station three, we have a back site of 0 0.563, and it is here. Then from station 2, we'll have a foresight of 2.985, 2.985. So this is our foresight at station 2, and this will be our back site where at station 3. Then we have an intermediate site of 1.235, it's here, intermediate site of 1.899, then intermediate site of 2.978, and then we have to cross our survey work with a foresight of 1.435. And it's here. So basically, with all this data, we can be able now to compute and uh, have our arithmetic check. Uh, we will start with reducing the reference, that is uh, subtracting our back site against our and our intermediate site. So we start with the first data here, which is 1.55 b minus. 1.025. If it is a positive, it will be a rise. If it's a negative, then it will be a fall. So 1.551 we subtract 1.025 is a positive, and then this one will give us 0 0.526 is a rise. So we have 0 0.526 is a rise. Then we have 1.025. 1.025 e minus 1.876 it will give us a negative of 0 0.851 so it is a 4 0 0.851 then we have 1.876 we subtract 2.683 it will also give us a negative of 0 0.807 0 0.8 Zero, seven. Then we have one point seven, one uh, zero point seven eight two. We subtract two point nine eight five, and this one will also give us a negative of two point two zero three, two point two zero three. So it's a four. Then we have zero point five six three. We subtract one point two three five, and this also will give us a negative. Of 0 0.672, 0 0.672. Then we have 
1.235 must subtract 1.899. This one will give us 0 0.664. And then we'll have 1.899. We subtract 2.789. This one will give us a negative 0 0.89. Then we have the, fa the, the final data where 2.8789, we subtract 1.435, that will give us a positive of 1.354. So with that, we can be able now to get our reduced therefore by, we, because uh, our reduced therefore is at reading 2, and this is 4, so to get reduced therefore at R1, we're supposed to take 9.58 and then we add 0 0.851 to get reduced therefore at R1 9.58.5 uh, 958.56 we add 0 0.851 and this one will give us 959 .56. And then to get reduced therefore at k, we have 959.56, then we add to 0. Point, we, reduce, we, we deduct from rise of 0. 0.526, and this one will give us 959.56, subtract 0. 0.526, this one will give us 958.885. Uh, from there we can reduce the reference basically 958 this is a 4 so if it's a 4 we subtract so basically it will be 958.560 we subtract 0 0.807 this one will give us 957.753 then this one we subtract 2.203 will give us 955.55 then 955.55 subtract 0 0.672 to give us 954.878 uh, then we subtract 0 0.664 to give us 954.214 then we subtract 0 0.89 to give us 953.324 and then this is a rise so it's 953 we add 1.5 1.354 this one will give us 954.678 954.678 so we can have our summation of backside and summation of foresight. So summation of backside will give us 1.551. We add 0 0.782, then we add 0 0.563. This one will give us 2.896. Then we have summation of foresight 2.683 plus 2.985. Then we add 1.435. This one will give us a summation of 7.103. Then we have our reduced therefore at K and then reduced therefore at uh, L. So we can check our arithmetic by having a, our arithmetic check will be summation of backside minus summation of foresight equals to reduce to therefore that is last minus reduce to therefore first first reduce to therefore this is first reduce to therefore and then equals to summation of rise minus summation of four So we can have it uh, as 2, summation of backside is 2.896, then we minus 7.103, this one will be equal to, summation of rice is uh, 
will be 0 0.5, 0 0.5 to 6. We add 1.354, and this one will give us 1.88. Summation of 4, we add all this, and then it will give us 6.087. Automatically, we have 1.88 minus 6.087 equals rice. First reduce to 4 minus last. Last reduce to 4 minus first reduce to 4, which will be 954.6. 954 we subtract 958.885. So all this will give us, this one will give us negative 4.207. 1.8 minus 6.07 will give us negative 4.207. This one also will give us negative 4.207. So our arithmetic check is okay. So, we have reduced the repos and the arithmetic check is okay. Join me for my next lesson where I'll be having a different question or the same question but using the height of coordination method. Thank you.